lately in the morning when I wake up, before I look at my phone, before I do anything, I take 30 minutes and I just blink my whole mind out. And then I just pray. I pray to be a better me. I pray for the people around me. I just pray that everything get better. And I do that, then I hit the gym. Family. We in the gym with it. Spit on me. I already know who it is. She got that one. The first day in, we breaking her in. She ain't really sweating like I wanted to, so we got to take her through this circuit one more time. My sister over there on the stairmaster dying. Look, she dying, y'all. <laughs> she dying like shit. I got to start that next week. I ain't, I ain't built for that. <laughs> I got on that shit two minutes later, almost died. Like I don't know what it is about them stairs. I don't know what it is, shawty. And I run up the stairs all day, but it's something about them motherfuckers right there that ain't right. Low-key crazy. But yeah, man, we getting it in. We getting it in. I told you there's no days off. I gotta have that muscle butt. No cap. So yeah, we about to get some exercises in. And we'll be back, Jack. Yeah. Alias, what the business? My nigga, the paper's what I'm at. Not peace, you ready? I need it. What's strap up? Your mission is to rip these bitches. Okay, let's get it cracking. Y'all bitches all ain't rapping. I'm the first lady, and baby, I'm boss thriller. Hoes wearing makeup, keep fixing your face up. I'm baking cake up, spending cash with Jacob. Oh, my pop, yo, this game, it was made for me. Most of these bras fitting balls wouldn't blaze a thing. On the block, selling rocks and some Maybelline. Yo, bitch, I sent a hundred shots through your neighboring. It ain't a game, y'all. Yo, when I twist the pine, straight goose on the rocks with a pinch of lime. I'm from the streets, bitch, niggas. This ain't just a rhyme. Cause I still like your block like it's Christmas time. And when I bag it, no, you see the cabbage grow. Nigga, about a half a loaf Tabasco flow, nigga. Simone the great, the truth is here. The entourage ain't hard, man. It's just a few quiz. Now, I done been around the game a long time. And I ain't never seen a bitch that spit like mine. Live wire is the click, we all shine. Y'all hoes better rewrite your rhymes. Now, I done been around the game a long time. And I ain't never seen a bitch that spit like mine. Live wire is the click we all shine. Y'all hold better. Rewrite your Family. We back from the gym. We are back. I just got out the shower. We about to um probably spark a little wakey bakey. I'm beat up. I ain't even gonna lie. It's not a wakey bakey. We had a wakey bakey on the way to the gym. Oh yeah, it's not a wakey bakey, but it's a it's it's whatever. Shit. <laughs> About to hit the yeah. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I'm beat up today. I can feel it, but I love to burn. I weigh myself in nine days. Um, my starting weight was what, 169, 167? Uh-huh. 169, 167, somewhere like that. So, yeah. We're going to look at the scale in nine, in nine more days. Um, I feel lighter. I feel a little lighter on my feet. <laughs> yeah, dig. I don't know what we about to do, but like I told y'all, we finna be vloggy, vlogging it on up. Shit. You know what I mean? I mean, intermission. I was about to intermission. You sound like somebody, Grandma Bessie. I said it's the intermission. I said the intermission. Yeah, dig. My hair looks crazy, y'all. I need to really get my hair dig. But I'm finna do something different to my hair, so I'm trying to really just like treat it and make sure you know my hair is healthy before i do another round of color i hate coloring my hair to be completely honest with you because i just don't like i don't like the brittleness of it it drives me berserk but i try to oil it as much as possible you know what i mean but i don't like all of it but i be needing a color sometimes just for a change because even if i do it, it don't look like it's done you know what i mean i can't explain it it's kind of like when you clean your house up and you don't rearrange the furniture, you know what I'm saying? It's like you know the house is clean, but it look really clean when you, like, rearrange the furniture. That's what it is. I need to rearrange my furniture. <laughs> if that makes sense. Yeah, man. So, um, yeah, we about to go ahead and do that. And um, we might go get some lunch or something. Something very light and cheap. Um, some salads or something. You know what I mean? I've been doing a very good job, like, eating correctly. And I'm going to continue. Because it don't matter how much time you spend in the gym. If you ain't eating right, it don't matter. 
You know what I mean? So, um, yeah, maybe we'll go do some lunch or something. Something very minuscule. Lunch, brunch. Lunch, brunch. Minuscule. Yeah, so we'll be back. We'll be back in a minute. So, apparently, we fell asleep in the midst of trying to figure out what we was going to eat. And we still haven't made a decision on where we was going to eat. So, um, I don't know. I guess we're just trying to figure out where we're going to eat. I think what we're going to do, the solution, is we're just going to ride until we find someone. Why is it? Drop it down in the comments. Why do you think it is so hard for couples to decide what to eat? Like, I don't know. We've always been like this, too. Like, we even did something on TikTok. As a matter of fact, follow our TikTok. We about to get back active on that thing. You know what I'm saying? Or whatever. But we did a whole skit about not knowing how couples can't decide on the eat. How couples decide on food. Earlier that day. What you want to eat? Like, we can do, we can do pizza. We could do burgers. Mm, I don't know. I do know that I am hungry though. Like I'm like starving. So. What about tacos? You want tacos? Mm, I don't think I want that. No. Yeah, we had that the other day. We can do wings. Like wings with some ranch. Wings? That be giving me heartburn. I can't do wings. Uh uh. Like that's just like a once a month thing. Like. It be burning my chest. I be having like terrible heartburn. Don't want to do the wings. Wendy's, Burger King, Chick Fil A. Mm, nah, I don't think I want that either. Thanks, my stomach hurt. Gives me. Fucking over this shit. Babe, wait. We could do tacos. Store. I don't care, man. It's been all day. Said tacos two hours ago. She's over it. And this is amazing. Like we was like so. Determined. I think really the reason why we fell asleep because nothing was really open that we really wanted to eat. Next thing I know, we was knocked out. And then here it's like, I don't know. Like if you try to go for brunch, it's bringing you to Midtown, all these fancy places, like fucking with the four dollar signs. Like I don't got that much money, nigga. I'm trying to go to the places that got the one dollar sign, Google. Don't send me to the shit that got the four or five dollar sign. I don't got that type of money. I can't eat in Buckhead, Midtown, and all them fancy places. You can, you just be broke. Just so like brunch, when you Google brunch, it bring you to the bougie shit. So then you try to look for healthy foods. I was trying to, you know, find my criteria, search my criteria, which is healthy foods. Search that, it doesn't bring you to nothing. Like, you get one place that got like some green lettuce and they're like, oh, this is healthy food, but everything else is fried chicken and french fries. I'm like, no, this is not what I want. Like, this is not what I want. This is not what I want. Like, what the heck? Like, you know what I mean? So it makes you like make bad, bad decisions because you just like forget it. I'm just we done pass, we done passed like six wing places, nigga. No cap. You know what I'm saying? So that shit'll make you just make the wrong decision. You all know the what time. I mean? All the fucking time. All the time. time. So like, I, my stomach is talking to me. I couldn't even sleep no more. I woke up out of my sleep she just my starving. Ass straight up. Starving. You hear me? Like, I was starving before I even went to she the gym. Was. And then I had a wake and bake before I went to the gym, came home, had another bake. Like, I'm I'm hungry. Okay? <laughs> I done burned off calories. And your, your sister didn't even need to burn off. Like, so I need to eat something. Okay. That's what we about to do. I gotta go get my baby some food. My and baby get my baby get violent when she don't eat nothing. Like it's that burning hunger. Like you know what I'm saying? That deep burning feel in the pit of your stomach. Like and it's loud. That's too. how I was. That's how I was the other day, baby, when we was making that food. Remember that's how I was? Ooh, I was so hungry. So I was yeah. so hungry. I'm just kind of like over it. I don't know. ATL, y'all just got too many damn choices for your girl. It is. It's like, so many I choices. I don't know. You can get so many damn different types of food down here, and it all be like so so much good shit, I bad was, shit. I was finna go for sushi, like fucking Japanese food, Thai food. Like, at this point, it's whatever is cheap for me. Like, it's... it's, it's it got to be reasonable, definitely. Reasonable, cheap. Like I said, don't send me to no places. I'm on the two star and below. Okay? Two, I mean, two dollar sign and below. <laughs> That's as much as I can afford right now. It's a two dollar. Y'all know what I'm talking about on Google. How I be showing you the price range of places and stuff. I look at that. So, look. What we about to do is we about to just uh, 
drive till we find something that we want. And then we're going to turn on the camera when we get there. Because I told y'all, y'all with us today. So stay tuned. It did. So we decided on, what is this car? The Crab Man 305. No, it's probably backwards. It's backwards. It's definitely backwards. So we decided on the Crab Man 305. So this was one of the uh, restaurants that was on the bucket list. We went to the one of No, we didn't. Bay, are you like serious? <laughs> this was nothing like Trick Daddy's restaurant. What the fuck? Listen, don't listen to her. We so we we said I don't know it, but it wasn't this. <laughs> I'll probably show that she has no idea what it is. So look, we finna try this. Hopefully it's good. I I stuck to the script, y'all. Even though I'm ready, to, I'm ready to go off kilter. I know for real, the music's got a copyright, big copyright. It was Sunday's eatery, but. <laughs> Get your girl play, nigga play the haze up Turn your face up and beat the block Turn your face up and meet the block I'm a certified G, I don't need to pop I don't need to go and get him to go against you Cause you were just probably going to get He's one of them hoes you rollin' with Know the code, so then you know a hoe is just a dough getter Cheese clutcher, cake baker, paper chaser Get in the way of my room laser Guarantee boy, y'all have the nature Live wire, not riding Lamborghini on wide tires Please believe me, I know you see me Y'all heard me be when I'm fly so we just got finished eating uh at uh we just got finished eating at uh the crab man atlanta honest review. and an honest review it, it it wasn't really that good you know what i'm saying i'm gonna be honest with you it was not macaroni and i don't know who in the hell was the corn one corn uh -huh. uh the seafood was actually really good you know what i'm saying but it was just the, it was just everything else just wasn't the way it wasn't hitting um i would not be back down here it wasn't getting um yeah they missed a couple I, assignments, but you know what? Well, shout out to them because yeah. they black on. They just got uh, some more growing oh, yeah. to do. Um, yeah, I wouldn't just be right back at yeah, all. You know like what I'm that. saying? But the seafood was pretty good. I will give them that. So yeah, man, we about to walk around for a little bit. They got a store right there, right? This is the one I looked up. Um, finna go to the store. Uh, I think we're in the for the wake and bake. A movie set. This man. Said. Yeah, we said we're in the middle of a movie <laughs> set, but hell yeah, get me. Yeah, I ain't. I made for TV. Oh, yeah. We also took a pic with someone. Oh, yeah. Shut up. You know, I didn't even get her didn't name. Get her name. Golly. You know who you are. Yo, shout out to you, baby girl, for the support. Um, we took Love y'all. Yeah. And, yeah, she seems like a sweetheart. Thank you so much for the support. Love you, baby girl. All right, but, uh, yeah, that's what we're about to do. So, we'll be back, Jack. So, they filming a movie down here, right? And look how they got the special effects for all the dead bodies that them blew up and shit. It's lit. See the man and shit. It's trippy, right? I'm finna go run up in there and get in there. Show them what I do. They gonna show them how to act. So yeah, they filming a whole movie, right? And the people was burnt up and shit. <laughs> they look real as hell, no cap. We about to head back to the car now though. Ready to head out. Shamika went to the whole store and forgot some rollies. Knowing we need to bait. She got the itis. I do, and then there was like dudes in there trying to talk to me, and I don't be, don't say nothing. She ain't tell me that until right now. See, she waited till we got two miles away from the establishment, cause I would have made a real movie down there, bitch. A real movie. Yes, ma'am. Yes, I am. Yes, ma'am. Yes, I am. All sorts of crazy. 